What's going on everybody? It's Zach from Switch Force and today we're doing something a little different and bringing you some DLC gameplay from LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 on Nintendo Incoming Switch. It Nick Okay, Nick, hold 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 the phone cap, okay? We're trying to do an intro. It's Black Panther week, baby. I'm super pumped for the movie. Gabe and I are both seeing the movie on opening night. I'm sure a bunch of you are excited for the film. It's got rave reviews. It looks to be a heck of a fun time. And normally we wouldn't be bringing movie madness into the channel, but it works here because Black Panther is on Incoming Switch. The, gosh, the interruptions, man! Black Panther is on Nintendo Switch via LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. So the DLC is available on the eShop $2.99. I also just kind of want to see how DLC worked uh, via eShop purchases. It's kind of interesting. You go on the eShop, and you can also exit through the game, but you go on the eShop, and you see the list of DLC. You pick that you want. You kind of check it off, and then it sends you back to the list. You can decide if you want to add more DLC uh, or just that pack, and then you go to purchase it. So let's see how nice this works. Welcome to the jungle, baby. Black Panther DLC. LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. Nintendo Switch Edition. Let's get right into it. Hey y'all, this time the exciting adventure I have for you guys takes place in the super secret country of Wakanda. Guess who lives there? That's right, Black Panther. He runs Wakanda along with his sister Shuri. She's something of a technical genius, which is handy given that Wakanda is one of the most technologically advanced nations on Earth. Whoa, cool spear! All of which comes in useful as things are always happening around these parts. Case in point, this guy, Everett K. Ross, has been captured. Last known location, the neighboring rogue state of Naganda. Uh-oh! Also reported to be in Naganda is Panther's arch-nemesis, Killmonger. So naturally, T'Challa's gonna have concerns as to his friend's condition. So, Panther's got a plan revolving around an old drilling machine left behind the last time some other villain tried to cause some tunneling trouble. Panther's still got the drill machine parked up in an old base somewhere deep in the jungle. Okay, so, this is Wakanda. Heard a lot about this place. Nice rhino statue. Hmm, not quite as nice as the brochure suggested. Wow, what a mess! Looks like Killmonger's buddies have been here and trashed the place. Once Black Panther and Shuri have completed their mission and rescued that Ross guy, they're gonna wanna get back here and clean this place up. Black Panther, baby. Here he is, looking all sorts of fierce, and breaking all the Legos like he's supposed to do. He's got quite a big jump. You can actually double jump, which is really nice. And we're working to find, looks like these three, like, satellite dishes, these radio dishes. Got some Crocs trying to cause trouble, and they definitely are. I guess these guys had better find a way to power this place up. The state it's in now, they're going nowhere. All right. Now here's something you don't see every day. A platforming section. <laughs> this will require skill and dexterity. Or, alternatively, a flying character. A flying character. We're going to use Black Panther. That makes the most sense here. Uh, that Gwenpool, a little bit on the annoying side of things. But it's okay. We will find a way. Um, Black Panther, what do you got going on? Ooh. Shoot that target off in the distance. I'm guessing that we can grab a hold of that thing. Maybe, baby. Maybe this croc. There's a gold, freaking golden crocodile over there. Can I jump on? Oh, I can. Okay. This guy. Oh, okay. There we go. We're going to use that as my magical source to spring off of. Come back. Come back. Come back. I'm on the attack. On the attack. All right. We're going to go the other direction. Let's go. Carry me to safety. Carry me to glory. Good moves, Black Panther. This guy definitely has has hops here. I like this a lot. Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2. Um, we talked about it uh, in our Valentine's video. I think it actually is a really great choice on Switch. It's a great co-op game you can play uh, with two Joy-Con. And it's just a, a quality experience. Like, the Lego games in, in recent years have been so stellar. And this one is no exception. It introduces Guardians of the Galaxy. And now you've got Black Panther, obviously a whole plethora of other pretty cool characters in the main game. This DLC was only $2.99. It's supposed to be pretty short. 
Um, so not a big investment. It's also part of the season pass if you have that. Uh, but we do not. We just wanted to check out Black Panther and see what that's all about. Um, got to get up higher. Okay. Where is my friend? You got to take me over here. I'm going to use another one of the spear action. Whoa. Oh, my God. Look at that. Just a direct jump. Okay, then. Missed. The game actually looks and runs really well on Switch as well. Um, I I don't know. Call me crazy. I, you know, I don't have the, the most... Whoa. <laughs> Did you see that? I, like, balanced on that thing almost perfectly. Unintentionally awesome slash awful. Okay. All right, Black Panther. I get it. I get it. You're broken heart. It's Valentine's Day. Um, there we go. No, but I, I, I'm not the biggest video file, but I think this game looks really good. And at least right now, playing it docked, I feel like it's it's hard to tell the difference between this and the like PlayStation 4 version uh, of Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2. Let's open this box, see what's inside, and we need a little uh, little Black Panther action. She's got to get over here. Let's go, girl. Wonderful. Up you go. Swing the vine. And here we are. Beautiful. Nope. Oh, nope. Alright, what do you want us to do? Oh, charge electricity. Okay. That's kind of cool. Look at that. Did not know that was a move. I love that LEGO decides to do, like, not only uh, introducing the new characters, but they give them a little level, and then you can play as the characters in any of the other levels as well. So it's DLC that applies across the board. And I feel like even if it's super short, three bucks is a pretty low investment. That's, like, cheaper than a pack of Pokemon cards, so. All right, another Disc of Doom has been activated. And now we can take a nice little ride. Down to the uh, the ground side. Let's see what's up over here. How many of you guys are seeing the movie this weekend? Let us know in the comments down below. How many of you have Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2 for Switch? Or how many of you knew it came out for Switch? Or how many of you now are going to consider uh, playing it on Switch? Alright, I want to be BP. Let's go, baby. Look at this guy. Freaking flamethrower? Are you serious? Dude must know Elon Musk. All right. There we go. Activate that gate. Open sesame. And we good. Look at that freaking Black Panther statue. I love how he just sends out these crazy discs. All right, that's for Doctor Strange, who we do not know or have at the current time. Oh, this is where I was, right? Yeah. Hmm, okay. So we're going back. Ow, I'm on fire! Somehow, being on fire alerted us to all of this over here. And it looks like that. That's what we have to activate next. I'm using the Pro Controller. I apologize for my sloppy Lego behavior, by the way. Oh, look at that. Alright, where are you at? Oh, she's over here. She's just already... She already knows where she needs to be. I gotta get our boy Black Panther on the same page, though. So, opening that gate did not mean much. The main point was to be down here. Alright, we'll let her stand. Nope, you stand here. Rise out of the swamps below. Activate the button to and fro. Oh, we got a crane. Okay. Giant mutated crocodiles love turkey dogs. True story. <laughs> All right. They love turkey dogs, huh? Yes. Get this thing out of here. I wish we could knock the crocs out of the way in the process. There we go, baby. They actually seem to be more riled up now. But they are at least going to stand put and give us a chance uh, to jump on their backs, which is very, very nice of them. So, what we're doing here is walking on 
killer mutated crocodile. I love it. Yeesh. This place is a health and safety nightmare. All right, charge this panel. Stan Lee, was that Stan Lee? He just said, get me out of here. Oh yeah, he's hidden on the levels. Forgot about that. Wonderful. Stan Lee is just real worried. I'm, I'm worried for him. He got a lot of anxiety up there. And probably rightfully so. He's stuck in Wakanda. He's, he's not even going to make it to the movie premiere if he doesn't hurry up. Oh, wow. Dude, my Crystal Panther! How are you going to do us like that? Even the skeleton is dumbfounded. All right, let's go, Black Panther. Let's investigate, okay? All right, we're gonna figure out what's going on. Who gave us the low score on Metacritic? Black Panther is actually real close to getting a freaking 90, which is insane. That's like a 98 on Rotten Tomatoes. All right, what is this? Ooh, it's the power source to the purple. Proton Bla Blaster. It's cool. I've heard they're doing Lego Incredibles later this year, uh, which is pretty awesome. I'm very excited for Incredibles too. I know. Again, now we're talking movies uh, on an Nintendo Switch channel, but hey, it fits. If it, I think, I think from now on, like Lego stuff is going to come to Switch. I kind of, I kind of just foresee that happening. It seems like. Warner Brothers is really on board with bringing the, the entirety of their Lego titles to Switch. Um, let's see. Can we... There we go. Yeah, get speared, buddy. Mmm. Slice, dice, everything nice. And we're good. Alright, get ready to charge another panel. Beautiful, baby. Collecting all the little uh, Lego bits and bobs is really addictive. You gotta be careful. Uh, I'm not a completionist, but this is a game that can definitely encourage that, just because it's so satisfying. We're all powered up. Now you just have to find a way of stopping a few thousand tons of water from falling. That's all. No biggie. Huh. A few thousand tons of water. Sounds like a job for Splash Mountain. Um. All right. Where is Stanley? We have not found him yet. But I can. I can't get on this laser. Whoa! Aha! Uh -huh. We stopped the water. Now we can enter the cave. Always wanted to say that. This is it, Gwen. You're living the dream. And out comes our magic drill, ready for action. No longer rusted by thousands of tons of water, we have prepared perfectly for this moment. I still want to know where Stan's at. Where's my man Stan? Uh-oh. <gasps> oh my god, the freaking rhino came to life! I suppose the panther god must be watching over Holy cow, okay. Can we fight this thing? Can I get the guy on top? Hey! There we go. Come on! Get him! Okay, you gotta be able to hit this guy, right? No? Maybe we can't. Oh, here, I think we need to get him to ram through these rocks. Get at me. There we go. Come on, bump these rocks. Let's go. Woo! Yeah, buddy. That's how we do. And he... he Doomed himself in the process. What a silly goose. There's a golden croc. Where is Stan? Stan the man, where are you at? There's another golden croc. Uh, Doctor Strange, I do not have you. I suppose even the Black Panther has limits. I just don't have any... How many of the characters with the gold stuff? Alright, well, I'm not going to worry about Stan right now. we got a mission to complete. Let's go build this up. Put our drill back together, baby. Now that's what I call a sweet ride. Vibranium tipped, powered by Wakanda.
armed in tech and ready to rescue Ross. Let's get drilling! There is nothing like a crazy drill machine to get you from A to B, or in this case, from Wakanda to Naganda. Sure, he's clearly got skills in the driving department, too. And that's without GPS. Everett K. Ross looks in good shape following his harrowing ordeal. But maybe he should get himself some protection so he doesn't end up in these scrapes. Poor old Killmonger. With a name like that, you're always gonna wind up in trouble. And things have gone perfectly for Black Panther. Wait a second, do Panthers actually purr or do they growl? A little bit of both. A little bit of both. More of a growl, I think, though, Gwenpool. I really don't want to hear you growl, though, so please don't attempt it. That is Black Panther on the Nintendo Switch LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 DLC. A very short little piece of story content, but again, you can use this character, these characters, I guess, across uh, the entire game and now in free play mode. And there's obviously more to go back and collect, and you can bring in other characters to said level uh, to fully vacuum up all the collectibles. Pretty darn cool. Available $2.99 on the Switch eShop. Interesting to see how DLC works, and interesting to see Black Panther. Let me know what you think in the comments down below, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you all have a fantastic day. Looks like we got quite a few cool characters from the movie and some cars, too. I think for $2.99, even though it's a short, bite-sized amount of content, it's, like I said, it's a pretty good price. It's less than a pack of cards, so you can't really complain. And it's cool to see Black Panther in the game. And I love that it's on Switch. So thanks so much for watching, everybody. Hope you have a fantastic day once again. Until next time, everybody. Switch Force.